What up, Angels and Saints? Your boy Aaron's back with another playthrough, with another Sega Genesis playthrough. Today we're playing Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, the movie, on the Sega Genesis, or Mega Drive, whatever you want to call it. So we're going to get right on into it. So, hope you enjoy Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, go! Alright, let's get into it. Sega Genesis. Sega Trademark. Ben Presto. Alright, so this came out in 1995 for Sega Genesis or Mega Drive. Long ago and far away, the legendary interdimensional being known as Zordon came to the city of Angel Grove to establish a vanguard in the never ending struggle against evil. With the aid of his trusted assistant Alpha 5 and Noble Master, saw out 60 extra. Come on, man. I didn't even get to read the rest. I'm not a fast reader. Got so we got Tommy the White Ranger. Got all the rages on six pages. Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, the movie, the game, let's get it, by start button now. Alright, before we start, let's go to the options music, the option menu. Okay, so we're going to, got normal, difficulty, easy, hard, you already know we're going to play on hard. Hard difficulty, I never played on hard difficulty before, but I remember I, I used to play this a lot as a kid, so. I should remember it as much as I can. We got music testing, voice testing. That's the. Oh. Alright. Hard difficulty. Play one. Let's get it. Six thousand years ago, a morphological being known as Ivan Ooze ruled the world with a. Re Did you know? Have you noticed? This is the exact same dialogue they used in the actual movie. Look it up. Watch, go back and watch it. This is the exact same line that Zorn said to the Power Rangers in that scene when they came to the, um, uh, what the hell is, what is it called? Command Center. Couldn't remember it. I feel like I'm getting old because I can't even remember what the place is uh, named in this actual shape. Stage one. All right, so we got all six rangers here. We got the blue ranger, which is Billy. We got the yellow ranger, which is Aisha. The red ranger, which is Rocky, which that looks like Tommy, everybody's favorite ranger, the white slash green ranger. But in this game, he's the white ranger. I looked online, a lot of people said that get the Green Ranger as a secret unlockable in this game, but I've tried so many times in the, over the years when I was younger. That's not true. I don't, well, at least I don't think it's true. I can never unlock it. They only mentioned it. If you play through the game, they only mentioned Tommy having the Green Ranger costume, but other than this, this is only um, Ranger of Tommy you can play. It's the White Ranger, White Tiger. You got the Pink Ranger, which is everybody's crush, Kimberly. We got the Black Ranger, which is Adam. So, hopefully, depending on how it is, you, I can't switch out. Usually, it's only uh, like six levels on this game. It's a side scroll um, BM up. But other than that, if anything, if I lose, I might just lose on purpose just so I can play as all the Rangers. But if not, I'm going to try to play as much as you the rangers but it's only like five levels you only could or four levels you get to pick a ranger and all the other stuff are boss levels so but anyway we're gonna let's start off with the red ranger Tyrannosaurus alright so we on the first level which is run through like a mall angel grove mall strip mall or something like that Okay, so basically, 
X is a special um attack. No, excuse me. A is a special attack. B is for a regular combo punching. And B is to jump. I mean C is to jump. I'm sorry. I'm using my my um, Xbox controller to play the game and getting me confused but I gotta remember for Sega Genesis controls we only had three buttons and if you hold the B button or whatever button you choose to use B for you hold it your ranger will start flashing and that's a special move so you got two special moves one where you can use your weapon and X which is a like a somersault backflip kick or something like that but other than that I remember on the cartridge version or whatever version this is there usually be two people in the middle laying on their knees but as far as I'm concerned as far as playing this level it don't even seem like it's a hard level right now I don't feel the difficulty here which you know you really ain't gonna feel the most difficulty out of these old games because I mean see I mean I think based off the difficulty level up the top uh, 45 seconds okay I get it so I used to play this game on, I just realized something I used to play this game on normal all the time never played it on easy but because this game is not really hard but I guess what depending on what difficulty you play it changed the time limit of how you could um, supposed to get past each section of the level so on normal difficulty it'll be 60 on hard difficulty is 45 seconds but the only problem with that is what makes it I guess what the developers might have figured to make it hard Every time the time runs out, goes to zero, your life starts to deplete. I'm going to show you in a second. Oh, man, I hate that. These people, that's all they do is try to, they choke the living life out of you. Look, like, like, you could be turned around or trying to get them in time, they still catch you. I'm going to slow down so I can show you what I'm talking about as far as the um, time limit thing. And also, their your opponent's life gets bigger. Their life gauge gets bigger for the difficulty when you change the difficulty to hard. See, they stay choking me, man. Spit a little bit. They move. So basically... This game really don't consist of nothing. It's a regular scroll beam up game. Side scroll beam up game. Only got 50 seconds. 15 seconds. I'm not even going to do nothing. I'm going to show you what I'm, what I'm talking about. Because I think this is the last dude. Dang it. This dude chasing me. But watch. See, my life starts to deplete if I don't go on to the next section of the level. Okay, we got the end of the level. And there goes Ivan Ooze. And just blows into the rings. Okay, stage bonus. I didn't even get that much that um, many points anyway once released from the chamber Ivan wasting wasting no time and attacks the command center the damage in Zoran and Alpha 5 so showing scenes from the movie but Zoran overthrowing the Power Rangers loses their power but tells them the, a power that will help save Zoran with hesitation Alpha sends the Power Rangers to the planet of Cradles. Warrior who will help them gain the power they need. Meanwhile, Ivan have gained mind control of the adults of Angel Grove and took, taken 
Alf Lloyd, Zed, and Rita. After landing on Fredos, the Power Rangers ran to Dulcia, the Master of Warrior. Damn it! She guides them to the Neolo Jank. She warns them of danger and sends them of their way. On their way. Man, I can't read today. I don't understand why. I graduated. Before they go, Dulcia gives them the Rangers animal powers for continuing on through their jungle in their new ninja uniform power. I'm just embarrassing myself. <laughs> I'm embarrassing myself. I can't read fast. Cause every time when I read fast, I mess up. It makes me think, I, it makes my, me feel like I can't read. I'm not even wanting to read cause I feel like I'm embarrassing myself though. Real talk. Cause they use the, you can't even read the whole sentence fast enough. I'm trying to read it out loud for y'all. With their new powers, the power, oh, see. Mm, it is what it is. But the thing is, with these levels, throughout the whole game, this game really don't really, it's not really based on the movie. Because the only levels that's based off the movie is level 1, 2, and the very last level, which is Ivan Ooze. When you're facing Ivan Ooze. The rest of the game consists of flashback missions of what they did in the actual TV show. When you'll see at the, I'm gonna show you at the stage too. So which, um, which power engine shall I use this time? Billy, Aisha, Kimberly, Tommy. I, I like the Black Ranger. I like Zack better, but I'm gonna get the Black Ranger. Adam. Oh, stepping on the Calypso. Thirsty, no twisted metal though. Bars, ho. Oh, oh my God, yo, you got ran over. So you're gonna have to deal with cars passing by and stuff. So. And obviously you can hear some of the music in the background, the recreation of the actual music they used to use in the show. I can't remember what actual song this is though. We need hero. I know because 
they about to choke the hell out of me. There's a bunch of, you know. And then, oh my goodness, man. It's about to get hectic. See, a bunch of people, a bunch of them just come out of nowhere. Oh my goodness, uh, they need to stop choking me. I'm trying to get them all in the cluster so I can knock them, see, like something like that, where I can get all of them out in one, in one swoop. There you go, see, they just trying to... So, to run is you double tap over or your directional pad and just... Just go, you'll start running. See, look at them. See, I'm, I'm about to lose more of my health if I don't get to the next section. Oh, I was about to run straight to a car. Sometimes I'll be forgetting when those cars are coming. Damn, they both try to poke me. And on this level, they barely give you any coins. Speaking of coins, I was about to say, you know, they barely give you any life. Um, they give you any help. Okay. So the coins consist of really all the six ranges special coins. Um, Animal coins, Triceratops, saber tooth tiger, white tiger. So, just basically go all six of, of their um, coins. And could even consist of prey, um, health, and extra points. See, that was life up, that was extra health. They stay choking me, I can't stand that. Jesus! I like that one because the developers try to make it seem like if the car ain't no wrong, they'll split into three. Oh my god, man, I'm getting jumped. See it? Oh, I thought they was about to do that again. See, they be choking me and stopping my animation. And now I'm losing health because they, I ran out of time. Alright, I believe this should be the last section of... This should be the last section of the um level I believe and then we're going to the boss and I'm about to get my butt whooped I'm about to die alright come on come on let's see if we can power through this and that's all they do is choke the living heck up goodness I've never had this type of trouble here on this on this game. Goodness. There we go. I like to do that pose under the sign we need a hero. Okay, here's the ball. Okay. So Angels and Saints, I'll be back with level three. Peace.